Hello beautiful people, welcome to Annibetti's Kitchen, the channel that makes eating an enjoyable and a health promoting experience. My name is Esther Ajaman, I'm your naturopathic and nutritional chef. What this means is that I help you use your food as your medicine and your medicine as your food. Today we are talking about turkey berry juice. So these are turkey berries. They are tiny, they are like eggplants, but really, really tiny. In Ghana, we call them konsusua. Um, you can get them in the African shops or the Asian shops. And these are packed with so much iron, natural source of, of, source of iron. And um, these are known as Heme iron, so iron from plant base are known as heme iron. They are not readily bioavailable. So when we say something is bioavailable, it means when you eat it, your body is readily able to absorb it. But this is not so. So we, it becomes bioavailable when you add a source of vitamin C. So natural sources of vitamin C is your citrus fruits like your oranges, your lemons, your limes, apple, pear, tomatoes. So I'm going to add apple because when you blend it by itself, another thing is that it's very, very bitter. So this helps sweeten it up and also makes it bioavailable. So whenever you're preparing your turkey berry juice, remember you need a natural source of vitamin C to add to it. So let's get on i'll put half a cup of the turkey berries don't worry i'll put all the measurements up there it will be up there on your screen and one apple so i'm going to core it and take all the seeds off so when you core it it means you're taking this and the seeds off then i just chop it up and we add it to it and blend so I'm adding about 500 ml of water. You can reduce it, 200 should be fine, but I don't want it too thick, so. And I'm using alkaline water. You use your drinking water. And there it goes. Then we just blend. So on your blender, wherever you have your puree or your smoothie set shape. So I'm using the puree. People, I'll take your berry juice is done. So what I do is, I uh, I get quite anemic. So genetically, um, my family, we get quite anemic. So if you've got anemia problem or iron deficiency problem, this is your go-to. And I remember when I was pregnant with Kay, I got solo in my last trimester and I was due for blood transfusion. I did this for five days when I went, my blood levels were up there, so it's that efficient. Since I've known that I never go for blood, I don't drink any blood tonic, this is what keeps me going. And I do this once a week, so once a week I do this on Sundays, and that's it, you drink. And it oxidizes really quick, um, it reacts with the oxygen, that's why the color is like that. I think when you add lemons, because normally lemons help fruits and vegetables, it, it stops them from oxidizing. I'll try with lemon and see, but you can try it as well. So there you go, your turkey berry juice is done. And then apple makes it really easy to drink. Whether the apple, trust me, is really bitter, unless you like beer and hard liquor that you are good to drink it like that thank you so much for allowing me to bring you closer to your health goals and if you haven't subscribed please subscribe hit on the notification button and if you love what you see give me some thumbs up and share it with your friends so together we live healthy and happy thank you ciao